Uh, fat guy, thank you for coming out. And saw the other fat guy, thank you for coming out. Uh, now, because listen, that's, that's what I see some of you guys, oh my God, he started with the fat jokes. I'm gonna tell you right now, that's what fat people do, okay? Fat people look at other fat people and we judge each other, right? Like, I'm serious, like I saw the way you looked at me when I got on stage, like he looked at me, he was like, oh my God. Hey baby, I'm not that fucking fat, right? Jesus Christ. But I want to help you out, fat people. There's certain things you can't do when you're fat, and if you're skinny getting fat, you might want to write this shit down, okay? Number one, don't eat chicken wings and rub your nose because you're gonna wake up in the middle of the night like, who the fuck's cooking chicken wings? And I know you're half Israel or whatever the fuck, but you're black too, okay? So that applies to you too, okay? And laugh at these black jokes too because I just found out I was black. I didn't know I was black my whole life. I thought I was Latino. I had no idea I was black now. But I'm okay with being black because Donald Trump's in office. Yeah, and I used to fill out paperwork that said Hispanic. And then I found out he was deporting Hispanics, and I was like, fuck that, I'll be a nigga for the rest of my life. I'm gonna shit. I ain't going nowhere, I'm staying right here. This... <laughs> the other thing you shouldn't do if you're a bigger person, can you please stop taking pictures from up here and putting it on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter, thinking that this angle is gonna make you look skinny. <laughs> Listen, at this angle is not gonna make you look skinny, okay? It looks like Google Earth took that picture for you. I call that a satellite selfie. <laughs> to certain things you can't do. You gotta realize, certain things you can't do, okay? Like, okay, true story, I was 550 pounds, right? I lost 200 pounds, now the reason why, no, don't clap, because I'm really fucking hungry, you have no idea. <laughs> but the reason I lost the weight is because I went through too many embarrassments, like this is what happened to me. When I was 550 pounds, I went to a water park. Fat people, not for you, okay? <laughs> I was dating this girl at the time, she had a five-year-old kid, she, she didn't want to get on any slides, he wanted to get on slides, and in my head I was like, I'm gonna take him on whatever slide he wants, because I'm doing a good deed, and that equals pussy at the end of the day, right? So I was like, choose a slide, let's go, and he chose a slide, and we got up to the slide, this is where I fucked up. There was no elevators, there was no escalators, it was just steps. Like, you gotta go up 1,500 steps to get to the top of this goddamn slide. But I was focused, because in my head I was like, pussy, 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 let's do this shit. And I started going up those stairs, but I was taking my time. And everybody behind me was pissed because they were trying to pass. They were like, excuse me, sir. And I was like, fuck you, bitch, I'm next. <laughs> yeah. So I get to the top of this slide, and the safety operator looks at me. He goes, hey, sir, how much do you weigh? And I was like, mind your goddamn business. <laughs> and he goes, no, sir, you understand. I need to know how much you weigh for safety reasons. And I was like, oh, OK. Well, I'm not really good with numbers. <laughs> but I weigh about 195 pounds. And he goes, well, I'm not good with numbers either, but we have a scale, so let's figure this shit out together. And I was like, touche, motherfucker, touche. And I get on the scale and it says over 500 pounds, and he looks at me, he goes, both of you guys can't get on the slide together. And I go, the fuck you think I'm not? You think I'm gonna go back down 1,500 steps after I told everybody no, putting my dick on those poor people's back? Fuck that shit, right? He goes, sir, you don't understand. You both can't get on together, but you get on by yourself. And I was like, oh, okay. Well, fuck this kid. I don't know him that well anyways. Who gives a shit? And I see some of you guys not laughing. You got kids. I'm going to tell you right now, I don't give a shit, okay? Because I'm 31 years old. I'm a Latino with no kids. I'm a fucking unicorn, okay? Yeah, my pullout game is amazing. <laughs> and I check off a lot. That's probably my problem, too. That is... I do, like I'm really good, like Asian guy, you look like you jack off a lot, right? Like you fucking, you go to town, like you ever do this, sir? You ever jack off and you know you're home alone? And then you hear a noise, freak out and stop, but it was just the ice maker that ever happened to you? <laughs> Don't say no, fuckers. It's happened to every dude in here, okay? Every, every dude's been home and they're like, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh my, hello? <laughs> and ladies, don't laugh too hard, okay? Cause you got those vibrators, they're loud as shit. Sounds like you're cutting grass in the room for no reason. Just bah, 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 bah. Ain't no Mexicans outside. <laughs>